Yeah, so a lot of states are attempting to legislate your Second Amendment the way they're coming up with all these so-called assault weapons bans. And, uh, you know, they're getting passed or they're uh, going to the governor's desk on some, in some of these states. I just like to say that uh, no one can legislate away your right. Okay, we have a Bill of Rights in this country, part of the first 10 amendments of our Constitution. We have rights, and the only way that your rights can be taken away, which really is not taken at all, it's forfeited. Uh, you have to forfeit your rights. See, when they write a law that says that your right is illegal, and you comply with that law, well, then you've given power to that law. And uh, you have forfeited your right. Now, our Constitution to these types of people is just ink on paper. That's all it is. They don't care about it. No one's going to enforce it. It's just ink on paper to them. And that's why they look for every opportunity to violate your constitutional rights. Because there's nothing anyone's going to do about it. So they think. Now, as far as their unconstitutional laws go... That's just ink on paper, too. That's all it is. See, until you comply with it, which gives it power, it's just ink on paper. Now, no one is going to stand up in our government to protect your constitutional rights. And it appears that that falls upon you. Now, there was a time in this country where men decided that uh, they were not going to give up those rights. They decided, well, we're the ones who have to enforce it. Now, I don't know what anyone's made of, and I'm not telling anybody to do anything. I'm just here to let you know that they can't legislate your rights away. You can only be the one who forfeits those rights.